Well, hello, hello, and good morning, good morning. How are you? It's nice and crispy this morning here, and I am getting ready to snuggle up with a book like I do every Saturday morning. Are you ready? It's baby ready. It's the family ready. Reading is so important, so fundamental to learning. You know, reading opens up your world and gives you experiences that you won't otherwise have if you weren't able to open a book. And so I love, love reading. I had a fabulous experience this week with my son who had a, an, um, a communications exam. And he was so worried about this exam. And he said to himself, he was saying to me that there was so much information, so much text to go through that he was a little scared and had his fingers crossed about the results. But before we ended the conversation, he texted me and said, ha, I got a 92, I did it. And you know what? I want to say that it's because he has spent a lot of time reading. He's able to process a lot of information. You know, the results may vary from child to child, but give your child the best, best option to succeed by introducing him or her to books as early as possible. Build those reading skills. So let's jump in. Let's dive in and see what our book is about today. It's called To Be a Kid. To Be a Kid by Maya Merja and John Ivanko. Hopefully, Maya, I said your name correctly. Correct me if I am wrong. To Be a Kid. And let's find out what our book is about today. What is this? Yes, that's the cover of the book. There is a front cover and there is a back cover. And what do the illustrations or the pictures tell us? Yes, it, they give us insight to what the book is about. So let's get started. To be a kid. To be a kid means being carried by those you love. Getting kisses. I'm getting a glare here. Let's get this straightened out so you can see it properly. Getting kisses. And spending time with family. To be a kid means going to school and learning new things. To be a kid means walking home together after school. Eating a yummy snack. Lots of friends eating together and sharing a snack together and playing with your pet to be a kid means walking running and spinning To be a kid means painting pictures, making music, and dancing because you love to. To be a kid means having fun. And making friends that last forever. Now, this is the last Saturday in the month of February, Black History Month. And I want you to take a minute and look at this, the, this picture. All the children in the picture. There's a lot of diversity 
lots of children from different ethnicity, different races. And I went to you moms and dads that as we consider and reflect on Black History Month, that you give the foundation to your child to explore different cultures, to love everyone, to build friendships with people from different backgrounds so that your life can be rich, your kid's life can be rich. To be a kid means making friends with lots of people that can last forever. The end. Did you like this book? Oh, this was a great book. I am so excited that you joined me this morning for our read time with baby. Let me know what you think of this book or what you think of the books that you have been reading with your baby. Adults, feel, feel, feel free to share what you have been reading too. So we all can grow and learn together. What fun it is to learn and to explore and to develop. This is Dr. Yonet thanking you this morning for being here and saying to you, have a tremendously outstanding, amazing day as you open more books and open up your world so that you can be a successful individual as you grow and develop.